Hello everybody, this is Dylan. I know that it's been a while, but uh, I'm finally back with a new project that I'm working on. Uh, in the time that I've been out, uh, it was mainly me working on school projects, things like that. I didn't really have time to start a new project, but now that the year's starting to wrap up, I think that I'll be able to start working more on projects that I want to make, such as the space game project. It's going to be a multiplayer, top-down, 2D, um, kind of combat game, hopefully maybe some resource uh, collection type game automation on the side, but primarily focused on space game combat. It's going to be multiplayer, and that's what I wanted to showcase today, uh, is the multiplayer, uh, yeah, just basically the multiplayer for the project. Now, it's pretty basic, it's not really doing too much now, but I just wanted to showcase what it looks like right now after one week of progress. And, um, yeah. In the time that I was out as well, I got a new keyboard, so you'll hear it less than probably my old key, uh, probably hear it less than my old keyboard, uh, used to, how loud it used to be. Uh, on the left, we'll have the server, and on the right, we'll have the client, just so that way we can, uh, differentiate between the two easier. So, I'm gonna choose server with two. It's going to initialize and then create the window. Now if I move here, you can see that our player on this window is moving, but this one isn't. This one in the corner is the uh, is the is going to be the client's um, the client's uh, player. It won't move until we have a client connected to control it. For right now, it only has uh, two players: the server and then one client. But I hope to make a make lobbies that may be dynamically sized to allow for many new players to join. Now that there's a client, it's starting to uh, send data between the two, and that's what these uh, running numbers are. So if I say on the server and I start moving on the left, you'll see that on the client side it moves. And then if I go and I switch to the client side, I'm going to slow this down a bit so it'll keep moving, you'll see that I can move it here, and it'll also move on the server side as well. So that's where we're at right now. Uh, I plan to next implement shooting and then uh, maybe some maybe add support for uh, multiple players. I still need to learn more about networking, so it would make for a pretty useful project to uh, figure out how to have multiple clients connected. That's pretty much all I wanted to showcase for today, so I'll end the video here. Uh, if you like this video and you want to see more of uh, more of these devlogs like I used to make, uh, especially of this game here, then please l like the video, subscribe, uh, turn on notifications so that way you can see uh, when I post the next update to this. And yeah, that seems to be about it. Follow my Twitter at dagdev323. That's where I post my uh, game updates as well. And... Yeah, that's it. That's it now. That's everything. Alright, see ya. Bye.